Hello children, now let us begin with the line wise paraphrasing of the Tempest Act 1 scene 1 but before that we will do the Dramatis Personae of the play. Alonso is the king of Naples, Ferdinand is his son that is the son of Alonso, Sebastian is the brother to Alonso, Prospero is the rightful duke of Milan, Antonio his brother the usurping duke of Milan who has forcefully taken the dukedom from his brother Prospero, Gonzalo is an honest old counsellor, counsellor means a member of the royal council. Adrian and Francisco are the lords, Trinculo is the jester that is the clown of the play, Stefano is a drunken butler, master of a ship, boatswain and mariners, Caliban is a savage and a deformed slave, Miranda daughter to Prospero, Ariel an airy spirit, Iris, Ceres, Juno, Nymphs and Reapers they are all presented by spirits. So we begin with act 1 scene line wise paraphrasing. The play opens with a shipwreck. The passengers are distinguished personalities. So the, in the first scene we see there is a wreckage of a ship and all the passengers aboard that ship are well known personalities. They include Alonso who is the king of Naples. Sebastian who is Alonso's brother. Antonio the usurping duke of Milan. Ferdinand, the son of Alonso, Gonzalo, an honest old counsellor and others. These are all aboard the ship. A furious storm is blowing together with the noise of thunder and lightning. There seems to be no hope of survival. There is no hope of survival for any of these. Most of the passengers are screaming and shouting in desperation. So most of the passengers aboard the ship, they are screaming, out of, shouting and they are scared full of a sense of hopelessness. The storm representing the chaos, chaos means confusion violence and disruption. Disruption again means confusion and disorder. It gives the play its title. So the scene is uh, on board a ship at sea, a storm with thunder and lightning. So you should know where the scene takes place. Enter master and boatswain. Remember master is the commander of the merchant ship and boatswain is an officer on the merchant ship. So master calls out to boatswain. Boatswain Officer, he is calling out to him, Officer, Boatsman, here master, what cheer? He says, I am here master, what cheer means, what do you want? Master, good speak to the mariners, he is, good means sir, speak to the mariners means go and speak to the sailors, fall to it yearly, fall to it apostrophes for the missing eye, fall to it means start work immediately or we run ourselves aground or our ship is going to get stuck, it will get grounded in the shallow waters, bister, bister, bister means move, move, come on, arouse, exit, he goes from there, enter the mariners, the sailors, boatsmen, he addresses the mariners, hi my hearts, he is trying to cheer them up, he says, come on, I'm, have courage, my hearts means my brave sailors, have heart, be, be full of cheer, cheerly, cheerly means heartily, heartily, my hearts, my brave soldiers, heartily, heartily, year, 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 year means quickly, quickly, take the top sail, take the Take hold of the top sail, tend to the, tend to the master's whistle. Please pay attention to the master's whistle. Exit mariners, they listen to it and they go away from there. Blow till thou burst thy wind. Thou means you, burst means burst, thy means your. So this is addressing the storm, that storm you may blow and blow till you burst your wind. If room enough, it does not matter till the time we have enough space to accommodate our ship in the sea. Enter Alonso, Sebastian, Antonio, Ferdinand, Gonzalo and others. Alonso, he calls out, good boatswain, have care. He tells the boatswain that please be careful. Where's the master? Play the men. He says, well, where is your master? Where is the commander of the ship? Play the man. He says, come on, have the show manly courage. Don't be so scared. Boatswain, I pray now. He says, I request you now. Keep below. Please go down to your cabins. Antonio, 
where is the master boatswain he says where is the commander of the ship officer boatswain is the officer where is the commander officer tell me boatswain do you not hear him so boatswain tells him can't you hear what he is saying to you you mar our labor mar means you spoil our labor means hard work you are spoiling our hard work keep your cabins please go down to your cabins you do assist the storm otherwise you are helping the storm to destroy us gonzalo ne good be patient ne means no good means sir he says no sir please have some patience boatswain when the sea is he says well i will show patience when the sea shows patience means when the sea becomes calm and patient i will also show patience hence means go away from here what cares these roarers for the name of kings king he says well these roarers these winds the tempest does not care for the name of the king it does not the winds and the waves do not care for the wind for the king whether the king is on board the ship or not they do not care so two cabin so go to your cabin silence please be silent trouble us not please don't trouble us any further gonzalo good good means sir yet remember whom thou hast aboard thou means you hast means have aboard means on the ship says sir but still remember whom you have on the ship none boatswain replies none that i more love than myself he says there is nobody else whom i love more than i love myself you are a counselor he says you are a counselor so you are a member of the royal council you are an advisor if you can command these elements if you can command the elements of nature to silence means the elements of nature will be the wind the waves the storm and the ocean if you can command them to be silent to calm down and work the peace of the present means and bring about peace right now we will not hand a rope more then we we'll, we will not handle even a single rope we will drop all the ropes use your authority he says come on use your power if you cannot if you cannot use your power and authority and control these elements give thanks you have lived so long then be thankful that you have been alive so long and make yourself ready in your cabin for the mischance of the hour and go back to your cabins and prepare yourselves for the mischance means the misfortune that may take place any moment if it so happen hap means happen if it so happens cheerly good hearts now he diverts his attention towards his sailors and he says heartily heartily come on my brave sailors have heart have heart don't lose courage out of our way i say now he addresses gonzalo and says please move out of our way and he exits then gonzalo speaks i have great comfort from this fellow he says well i have great confidence in this officer that is the boatswain me thinks means i think he had no drowning mark upon him i think there are there, there is no mark on him that indicates that he will dr- die by drowning that is why he has no sign on his face to show that he will die by drowning his complexion is perfect gallows by looking at him i can see that his a complexion means its appearance it shows that he deserves to die by hanging gallows means by hanging stand fast he says stand fast means be firm good fate be firm good fate to his hanging that is be firm fate and allow him only to die by hanging make the rope of his destiny a cable that is only his destiny that is to die by hanging can save us it will be a cable means it can save us for our own doth little advantage for our own destiny own doth means our own destiny does little advantage advantage means benefit our own destiny can do very little 
benefit for us so our destiny depends on his if he not born to be hanged our case is miserable if he is not born to die by hanging then our situation is also miserable means it's really bad he says this and he exits from there Botswain re-enters, that is, he enters again and he says, Botswain, down with the top mast, he says, put the top mast down, that is, bring the top mast down. Now, top mast is the section of the mast which is fitted to the top of the lower mast. Here means right now, lower, lower, come on, lower the top mast. Bring her to try with the main course. Bring the top mast down and bring it close to the main course means to the main sail a cry within they hear a lot of shouting inside the cabins and he gets angry and he says a plague upon this howling he says this may a curse fall on these people who are screaming and shouting they are louder than the weather or our office he says their voice of shouting is louder than the weather means it is louder than the noise of the tempest and the noise of the roaring uh, winds and the waves of the ocean and our office means and all of us who are working over here the screaming is louder they are the passengers re-enter Sebastian, Antonio and Gen Gonzalo. They enter and he says yet again, he says you have come back again. What do you, what do you hear? He says what are you doing over here? Shall we give over apostrophe is for the missing we? Should we give over means should we give up and drown? Should we stop trying to save the ship and should all of us drown? Have you a mind to sink? He says, have you made up your mind that you have to drown and you want to die by drowning? So, uh, Boswin, work you then. He says, come on, your mind to sing, sorry. Sebastian, a plague on your throat. He says, they may your tongue be cursed. This is an oath. May a curse fall on your tongue. You bawling, blasphemous, incharitable dog. Bawling means you howling. Blasphemous means talking irrelevantly. Incharitable dog. You are an unkind dog. May a curse fall on your tongue for saying this. Portswain, work you then. He says, okay, let us do our work now. Antonio, hang, cur, hang means may you be hanged, you dog. Cur means dog. You insolent noise maker. You insolent means rude noise maker. You are so rude and you make such a lot of noise. We are less afraid to be drowned than thou art. We are less afraid of drowning than you are. Thou art means you are. We are not so afraid of drowning as you are. Gonzalo, I warrant him for drowning. He says, I guarantee. Warrant means guarantee. I guarantee that he won't die by drowning. Though the ship were no stronger than a nutshell. Even though the ship is not more stronger than the shell of a nut. But still I am sure he will not die by drowning. Boatswain, lay her a hold. Lay means please stir the ship away from the shore. A hold, a hold means hold her steadily. Set her two courses means uh, let us set the two courses means the foresail and the mainsail. The two courses are the sails which are attached to the lower yards of the ship. So let us take off, take her off to the sea again. Off to the sea again, lay her off, let us take the ship again to the sea. Re-enter the mariners wet, they are totally wet. Mariners, all lost to prayers, to prayers, all lost. He says, we are all lost, we are going to dry, die, all of us. Let us say our prayers, everything is lost, we are going to die. Boatswain, what? What? Must our mouths be cold? He says, must our mouths be cold means should we die? That is, would we die by drowning? 
Gonzalo, the king and prince at prayers. He says the king and the prince, they are saying their prayers. Let's assist them. That is, let us accompany them for our case is as theirs because our case is also as bad as theirs. Sebastian, I am out of patience. He says, I have lost all patience. Antonio, we are merely cheated of our lives by drunkards. He says, we are going to die because of these drunkards. We are merely cheated means we are completely cheated of our lives. We are going to die because of these drunkards. The white chapped mouth, white chapped mouth means the big mouth rascal, that chap over there. I would thou mightest die, lie drowning would means i wish that you thou means you mightest means my might lie drowning i wish that you die by drowning the washing of ten tides may you be drowned and may ten tides wash over your dead body may you drown to death and may ten tides wash over your corpse Gonzalo, he'll be hanged it. He says, this man is going to be, go to the gallows. He is going to die by hanging. Though every drop of water swear against it. Although every drop of water in the ocean is swearing against it. That is against his him dying by hanging. That and gape at white wits to glut him. And it is opening its mouth wide in order to glut means in order to swallow him that is it's the the ocean is opening its mouth wide in order to swallow him that is to kill him by drowning a confused noise within there is a lot of noise in the cabins within and then he says mercy on us he says may god have mercy on us we split we split that is the ship is breaking the ship is breaking we are going to die farewell my wife and children he says goodbye to you my dear wife and goodbye to you my children farewell Farewell, brother. Brother, goodbye to you. We split, we split, we split. We are going to be wrecked. The ship is going to be broken into two. We are going to be destroyed. Exit the boat swell. Then Antonio, let's all sink with the king. He says, well, let us all go and die with the king. Let us all drown with the king and die. Sebastian, let's take leave of him. He says, well, let us say goodbye to the king before we drown and die. Exit Antonio and Sebastian. They go away from there. Then Gonzalo, now would, now would I give a thousand furlongs of sea? He says, I am ready to give a thousand furlongs is a unit of measurement of distance. I am ready to exchange a thousand furlongs of the sea for an acre of barren ground. For an acre of barren means a dry barren land. I am ready to exchange so much land for one acre of barren ground. Long heath, a barren ground that may have this Long heat means the wild plant, brown furs means the spiny shrubs, brown in color, anything that is I am I'm ready to have any anything that is the total land barren full of the shrubs or the thorny bushes. The wills above be done. Let the will of the heavens above may they be fulfilled. But I would fain die in dry death. That is I would means wish. Fain means gladly, but I wish and I gladly would dry die on the a dry death that I would gladly die on the dry land rather than dying by drowning. Hope you've understood. Next, I'm going to come with the video of Act One, Scene Two. Thank you.